Africa should now expect a leadership that will ensure that the Pan-African Parliament is brought back to its core business of ensuring that poverty on the continent, people of Africa are suffering, it's not a secret. Africa lags behind in all aspects of development. When I talk of education, when I talk of the general economic development, per capita incomes, everything, any index of development, we are behind. Not because we don't know, but because institutions that are supposed to push the agenda of development have not performed very well. I, I should not be shy to say, but African Parliament has been performing below expectation of the citizens of Africa. Some don't even know what it means. People now need to know that there's a parliament for the continent, which should even harmonize some of these uh, move, immigration laws, movement from one country to another, issues of visas, for example. People have problem, problems moving across countries within the continent. And we are fighting that we should relax some of those visa regimes, or people should be free to, to move from country to country. And that the trade among uh, African countries should now increase with the, now the, 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 the African Continental Free Trade Area, FCTA. PAP should play a leading role in making sure that people are aware of that and the trade regimes are harmonized. Zimbabwe is the vice president of the caucus for the whole continent. We have a caucus for women, caucus for the youth. These are some of the programs that you will see blossoming, you will see uh, take, taking off in a more vibrant manner as a result of my, my leadership. So I will remain Chief Charumbira by Charumbira because that one takes me to become a member of the National Council of Chiefs. And then, then I'm elected the president of the National Council of Chiefs, and then I become a member of parliament, and then I go to PAP, and then I become president of PAP. So yeah, these are building blocks to the, to the ultimate seat of president of an African parliament.